Grand Prix Insights is presented by Allianz. Hi, I'm Nico Rosberg, race driver for AT&T Williams. Today I'm going to take you around the Melbourne Grand Prix circuit with me. And the funny thing is, I'm going to do it blindfold. So we start on the, on the main straight, hard braking in the end because we arrive with quite a high speed into a third gear corner, all the way down into seventh gear, uh, about 300 kilometers per hour in the end. Second gear hairpin down there, we have to go over the curbs inside, so we come out of that second gear hairpin. Then comes another third gear corner, very, very hard again over the curbs on the inside and the outside. Then comes this flat out corner, which is about fifth gear, which I'm not sure how it's going to be this year because of the wall changes, it really depends. So maybe we're going to have to lift off the throttle a little bit. Then we go down here through the trees. There's a lot of trees here, which can make it quite difficult also for the engine, um, because if the leaves go into the car, it can easily overheat the engine and the engine can then break. So we go down here into another third gear corner. Then uh, on the back straight, quite a long back straight, which has a little bit of an S, which I now messed up totally, but anyways, um, going down all the way down uh, seventh gear again down the straight. Very, very bumpy here on the brakes. Um, so second gear corner again here, hard over the curb on the inside. Then we come out of there into a longer straight again. A very, very fast left hander and a very fast right hander again, like a, like a quick S. And then we come towards the last part of the track, which is quite a fast right hander here. Um, into a small hairpin, again very, I think it's the slowest part of the track here second gear corner and then we come just out of there and you've got to get the line right for the next part because the next corner is very important because it's the last corner onto the onto the main straight and uh, this corner is nearly flat so you're just up shifting and you just have to lift off the throttle a little bit because you have to be a little bit careful because on the outside there's a wall so you can't afford any mistakes and, uh, and that's it so now you're back on the main straight and the start finish line that looks pretty good actually so I hope you enjoyed that, I hope it was interesting, and keep your fingers crossed for us on the weekend. Grand Prix Insights was presented by Allianz.